Hi, I'm Scott, and I'm going to give a quick demonstration of this Rigel DS1052E oscilloscope. I currently have it hooked up to a uh, high voltage power supply that is using uh, about a 20 kilohertz wave on the uh, yellow axis, and the blue axis is the voltage going into the uh, inductor. So let's look at a few things that this thing can do. It's got a run and stop mode there, which will pause the display. You've got storage. We could store uh, this waveform internally, or we could store it to the uh, the USB port there. There's measurements. So, for example, we can add a measurement uh, channel two, maximum voltage, channel two, frequency, period. those measurements off. Channel 1, time, frequency. That's pretty handy to be able to do that. It's also got a mode that will measure everything at once. So we could hit uh, display all down there and it tells us the maximum voltage, average voltage, peak to peak, frequencies, periods, all that uh, good stuff there. Um, not a whole lot to say other than it uh, seems to work pretty well. Been pretty impressed with it since I got it, since it was uh, so cheap. Various different uh, trigger modes you can set up. All kinds of different horizontal modes you can set. automatic mode that will uh, automatically set everything up for you. One of the nice things about this scope is that it's uh, really pretty compact. So if you look at it, it's pretty small. It's only that big. On the back it's got some ports for uh, USB control for the computer. Uh, it's got a port there for a uh, pass-fail setting. Overall, uh, pretty impressive for a cheap little uh, digital storage oscilloscope.